What's going on guys? This is Jimmy Bailey bringing you today's episode of Morning Mission. <clears throat> Today we're playing a little bit more of Metro. Um, I'm kind of doing a full playthrough, so this is video number three. So if you're following along, uh, this is number three. L last time what happened was we found the train. Um, we escaped from the people that caught us look from the train. Um, and then we ran into my father-in-law, or Anna's father. And... Uh, you know, found out that he knows a little bit more than he's letting on, that there are people that aren't sick, there's areas that aren't full of radiation, and that the order in the Russian government have been blocking radio signals from the entire world, so that everybody thinks that Russia's dead. Because supposedly the, world, war has, the, the war has not ended. We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder. What next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked? I tried playing this part yesterday. Yes, and it wouldn't work. I was supposed to be doing something with the radio and it wouldn't allow me to. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who were those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something, at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you uh, mean, what? did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, command chose the only viable course of action. To play dead. To ensure radio silence, the shield system was created. A network of radio jammers. Okay. Moscow and suburbs. So that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't... It's not a bad idea. Down on our heads by you think you're doing the best thing. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you yeah, we not did it. have shared that before? Say, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago. Under a strict, you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down the station, shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for more than just protecting their asses? You mentioned the Ark. What's that all about? If our team finds their signal, you'll figure everything out. Otherwise, there is nothing to talk about. Do you think finding that Ark of yours is going to fix everything? I do not. But if you have a better idea, then go ahead. Yes, I do. Wait a moment, what was that? Everyone who can hear me, everyone still loyal to the cuts. Listen, everyone! Alright, let's go. Is this what you had in mind? Yes, this is it. The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's sure HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. 
They have already started the restoration work. We will tell them that Moscow is alive. It wasn't all for nothing. They know. Everything will change. Everything. They won't. Get it. A new life is starting for all the survivors of the <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So what? The, the voice acting is so awkward sometimes. Bring it out to me. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir, that thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. Do <laughs> you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> <laughs> so awkward. It's not a short trip to the Urals. So we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Well, let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, huh? It's about time. Let's go around and be done with it. <laughs> nah, go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> Even better. <laughs> Come on. How about Aurora? The Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what. <laughs> Let's do it. Come on. I like it. Can we just play the game? Beautiful name. Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's drink to the Aurora! Didn't finish our drink. Hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. Yermak, full steam ahead. Hi. Full steam ahead. Wow, that's some distance. I wonder how long it will take. You can resume the journey by continue or continue explore. <laughs> you sure you're okay? Because I know you. Just so you know, scars attract the And there's definitely a lot of those up ahead. I don't need a lot, really. It's quality that matters. Anna, can I just get past you? Thank you. Oh, it seems to me, whether it was intended or not, that our colonel now has a goal to strive for because of you. We all remember the way you fought back in D6, so no matter what lies ahead, we're with you. You can count on us. Okay, thank you. That's what yeah. I want to hear. Yes, as for me, I'm running a little inventory check. Yeah. It is kind of cramped in here. Well, I'm thinking of making something of a work. Oh, definitely. That's what I need. So that's all the instruments we get, and everything else would be within arm's reach. With no workbench, you just lose small components. We'll use this place to work on the weapons. Cleaning, boiling, keep out of everybody's way, and keep them from messing with my stuff. Ah, well, we'll have to take turns, of course, but we'll manage. So, if you find any weapons you'd like to keep, I'll store them for you here on the Aurora, and you can come back to exchange them. You'll get them back in their best shape, <coughs> don't you doubt. Boy, have I cleaned and oiled a lot of weapons in my life. Hmm, factory and homemade too. Some of those were just amazing. Come so on, I want to be able to switch my guns. So, if you have any weapon related questions, I know that. And weapons, they are like girls. Oh my god. I guess I can't switch weapons yet. Uh, 
At first they got me to sign I guess maybe after when I return to the train again I'll have a workbench. After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh, intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years, we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they while we were exactly. eating each other alive in the metro? Years. We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau. If we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control, according to Miller. And we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small team against the occupation armies? What are the chances that we'll succeed? That we'll get some answers? It's slim. But you got Jimmy Bailey. Is it still loading? Jesus, it's taking forever. Something's wrong. <laughs> Come on. Dude, what is up today? There we go. Jeez. Scared me. Better. It's got to be a wide open area. Maybe that's why the load time was so long. Anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. They're definitely Russian. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life, the life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the bridge! Oh shit. Four bogies on a trolley. Let's go. Church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom, I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that breach. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. Yeah, I go with Artyom too. As backup. No, until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two can handle themselves just fine. Yermak, when can you get the Aurora running again? Yeah, I don't know yet. I like it. That's cool. Spartans, 
Let's prepare the Aurora for a defensive action. Let's go, Artyom. Stepan, Damir, get the perimeter. I'm on yes, sir. Duke. I need you to recall the immediate area. Got that, sir. Artyom, don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. A portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Okay. Let's move out, Artyom. Just be careful out there. Sure thing. Well, that's all. Good luck, guys. I gotta say, that was one flimsy roadblock. Old R1. Well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies by conviction or out of fear. Got it. I can craft those, okay. Do you hear that bell? We must have given them a good scare. Ah, oh, sweet. Why would I Is that taking it off? Cause I already have that scope on there. Oh, okay. I guess it just told me I got that scope. But can I put on this gun? That's what I want to do. I don't think so. Oh, I can! Alright, cool. Awesome. Now my aim is gonna be better. I hate iron sights in every game. I love looting. Nothing. I took a look around while you were inside. Of course you did. That electric tower there looks like a perfect sniping position. Let's go. All right. Wow, it is a big area, huh? Can't go in the water, I guess. Celebrate? Is that the right answer? Is that what she's looking for? A pitcher of beer or piss? <laughs> Is 
The dirtier your weapon gets, um. Yes, I'm looking around, Anna. I feel like you're gonna be rushing me the whole time. Oh, let's see. I can either break it down. Ah, oh, that's a cool looking weapon. That is dirty. Alright, so I guess breaking it down would have given me the scope. But I just manually did it. Okay. That's good to know, actually. Because I want to keep the silencer. I can't take your pad. What the hell is my heart pumping for? Hasn't been much yet. Well, it's been kind of a pointless building, huh? <laughs> Nothing I could take, right? Oh my god, the, the looting takes a little bit too long. I should just be able to tap it, not hold it. And then... What can I craft? It's a med kit. Oh, I can... Dismantle it, too. So... Gas mask filter, med kit. Oh, I can do... I can craft knives, too. Okay. Okay. Last game, you weren't able to dismantle stuff, so that's a great addition. Hopefully, searching this house doesn't kick me into the cutscene, because it is close to the objective. It's so hard to tell if it's junk on the floor or crafting stuff. You literally gotta look at everything. Like, what on here is crafting? 
just that glass bottle. How was I supposed to tell that? You literally have to look at everything and see if something pops up. Okay, Artyom, I'll climb up there while you take the boat to the church. I'll call you when I'm settled. Right away. Good, I have my charger again. Dude, my gun is dirty as hell already because I found that water. Wait, use the L2. Why isn't it going? Dude, what am I doing wrong? What the hell? I'm rowing. Artyom, I'm at the top. It's an excellent spot. I must be doing something wrong. I'm an idiot. I gotta be. Unless I've just got it stuck already. Oh. You hold one. You don't go back and forth. You just hold R2. And then L2 is to back up. Hey, it's a Murlocker. Meyer Lurker. From Fallout. I'm just gonna fight them. Come on, Mr. Meyer Lurker. The water looks great. Take those parts. Awesome. I do like the crafting system or the the modification system. It's actually quick too. Like if you get the once you get the hang of it, it looks like it's gonna be quick. See, it has all these little hiding areas that like they could have hidden stuff in. There's nothing there yet. Alright, back in the boat. Oh, unless we check this house. Oh, looks like you've been spotted. Artyom, there's a woman on that bell tower waving a rag or something. Please investigate. I see people at the church. None seem to be armed. We'd better try the open approach. Let's not fire first, okay? I'm trying to save people, not kill people. I ain't firing. Looks gorgeous, man.
I can't get out in this house, right? No. Dude, there's so much to explore, I'm loving it. Sounds like a cult. Looks like Fallout. Has already started his sermon. Just enter the temple and see the light of truth. It sounds like a cult. What's up, little girl? What? It's a kid! Oh! How do I sheath my weapon? Wow, this cult is gonna be fun. Mama, it's him! The man from the train! He's here to save us! I can't believe this! I had all but lost hope! We're not from here either! Silantius like locked us up here a year ago! Yes, the bridge dwellers won't even talk to heretics. But I'll tell you everything I've seen Our in this place all a that year. Arriving under the cover of fog. Oh, it's the bridge guard. Silenti has fooled them just like the locals. But unlike them, the bridge guard have guns. Run! There's a way out down here and there's a boat at the dock. We also have one, but it's too small for all of us. Sorry, little man. Go! We better. I can get to your tree by ourselves. Finally, it's not just mutants. I can fight humans. <laughs> I guess knocking out's quieter. Oops. <laughs> trying to figure out the backpack still. Now why did they give me all this at once? I got a kid ass gun now. I'm liking all the parts I'm getting. I 
Let's check over here first. People right there gotta be careful. I like having multiple routes you can take. I wish there was a peak button. Tiom, I can't cover you when you're inside. I'm changing position to meet the woman and child. I know you can handle this just fine. I see his flashlight, so he's looking this way. We're gonna try going stealthy. There he goes. Crazy cult. I love having multiple roots. Is that you, Danya? Could you walk me to the loo? I can handle the corridor, but the ladder. Was this a hidden area? Why or so you can hide? Why are so hard? Is it you, Boris? You can walk me. Nope, we're loading. <laughs> I'm gonna go stealth. This game's taking a while to get building, but now we're finally starting to play. While well, using jump while sprinting will allow you to jump further. Wow! If you miss throwing knife, you can always collect it. I hope I can upgrade, like, Artyom. Make it so he walks faster, crouched, and stuff like that. That's the room. Alright, I might need to go a different way. Did he see me? No, not Siri. <laughs> Maybe we can knife him.
so many of them. God damn it. <laughs> I was trying to wait to see if he'd go past. I'm gonna go the other way. If I get seen again, we're just gonna go lab. I don't know why I really want to go stealthy, though. What a tip. Aim down sights for more accurate shot. <laughs> Some of those tips are helpful, others are dumb. Actually, we might have to go that way. Might have to go loud. We're just going loud, dude. Gun! The gun had a misfire. I get it. Are you kidding? It misfires that much when it's 30? Holy shit! Wow. All right, well, I mean it. If it goes loud this time, if, if we get seen, we're just gonna go loud and kill everybody. I was trying to mess around with the gun, try figuring it out, but. You got our knives out, right? Yeah, okay. I gotta figure out how to clean my gun. It must be at a workbench. I wish you could creep around corners. Prepare for the Lord's just retribution, you heretic! The guy across the way is scaring me. How? Come on, come through. We have to surrender. Something tells me they're not gonna surrender. Now how do I put this in full auto? I'm gonna look up, I gotta look up how to clean my gun because I definitely need to clean my gun. I'm not gonna kill you if you're surrendering, but I definitely don't want you awake. Dude, the aim set or the sensitivity just looking around is so 
like low, but when you go in here, it looks super high. See? The sound of a stealthy kill can be heard over a much shorter distance than any other kill. What? All right, that's a bit better. Oh yeah. Not great, but it's still better. It's definitely more of a PC game. I'm not here to hurt you guys. Why are you crying? That's where the women and children are. It's locked, right? Now imagine if I could have done that stealthy, like I wanted to. Hey, if they say you worship the devil, is that true? Will you teach me? I'd make a good apprentice. A really, really good one. Come on. Dude, fuck off. <laughs> Guy's ready to trade his whole crew in for the devil. The heretic? <laughs> well, just, just shoot me. Come on! I wish you'd just shot me. Damn, my daughter and my son. I don't want to hear about it. <laughs> ah, these are the traps I can disarm. Cool. Well, if I was able to go stealth, that would have been great. Where am I supposed to be going to that boat? Yeah. I'm embarrassed of this gameplay so far, man. <laughs> My aim has been horrendous. I've been having to reload. Checkpoints. I like that, like, you, the dirtiness and affects your gun, but then again, I don't like it. Are you alright? Great. I was starting to worry. You raised some hell in there. I just kiss you right now. Though, I've got to take Katya and Nastia to the Aurora, so see you there. Check the map. Looks like you can row straight there from your position. No, these things attack your boat. Where are I? Oh, there we go. Okay, it is in... <clears throat> it is in auto mode. Are you kidding again? It jammed right after. Dude, I gotta figure out how to clean the weapon. Here. 
Are you kidding? <gasps> what is that? Oh my god! Oh my god! A mutant fish? What the fuck was that? A whale? It's fucking huge! The old man sent me out as a forward sentry. Told me that I was to sit tight and under no circumstances look for any action. So I just had a front row seat watching you there. Uh. And so you subdue the occupation forces peacefully with a holy cross and a prayer. <laughs> Anna has already reported on the cult. How about we trade places? I'd hate to come back to Moscow without even firing once. I was trying to win a girl over from one trader. Tough luck there. Why does everybody else get fun missions? The colonel does criticize you and all, but he gives you all the best action. Is this his way of showing affection or trying to get you killed? But I have to say it's unfair. I've been dragged out of Moscow and for what? Stalking the furnace and sitting in a bog with Are you going to come or are you just going to stay here? Here though, we do have a chance of finding some loot. There is this plane there. Oh. Just leave something for me. I'll have to stay longer, I suspect. Alright, so he's staying, he gave me the location of a plane. The shrimps are giving me trouble though. Those were shrimp. I wish I could somehow talk to that cat. <laughs> Alright guys, that's where we're gonna end today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Obviously, gameplay was pretty lackluster on my end, the skill level. But now with that sensitivity and me figuring out how the jam works, I think uh, I think we'll be able to figure it out a bit better. Alright guys, have a great day and remember keep on gaming. Peace.